Okay, so we've been uh, working on a few videos now on how to develop the strength in the shoulders, in the arms, in the wrists and hands, and also in, in the whole body in general by doing these plank positions on the wall. So here, I'm gonna reverse um, the, the usual plank so that you can see um, how to work with it. So I'm going to lay down on, the, on my mat here. I'm gonna use a block to measure the height of my shoulder. Okay, so once I have that down, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I come here to the wall and I measure the height of my shoulder, okay? So from sit, sit bones here to shoulder, I see that my shoulder hits about the top of these metal plates. So I'm going to add some uh, locks here that come to about this area. And, you know, in the beginning, they can be lower, and then you can raise them um, as you're able to. So we'll start off with this height. You might have to lower it a little bit. So what you're going to do is you're going to bring your hands to where this block is, and you're going to place the hands uh, with fingers pointing towards the wall. So fingers pointing towards the wall, not um, the opposite from you. Okay, so I put my hands here, shoulder widths apart, and I bring my pelvis as close as I can um, to my feet, okay, and I put my feet up. And then, of course, you know, I have to come up and my hips will move back, but I don't bring the hips back initially. I try to just think of bringing the hips up, okay, up and then straighten. So. And the reason I do that is if I bring my hips back to get up like this, I lose contact with the wall and it's almost impossible to get up. I'm gonna actually adjust these to have a little less height. Okay. Here we go. So I push, I come closer to the wall and I get up. And I work here. So again, not uh, working on not having a dip, right? So strengthen. Make the legs very active, arms very active, and eventually you can get rid of the blocks against the wall. Okay? Um, perhaps this sometimes I find useful. If you have a wheel, you can start off with your wheel here. And bring your hands back, pelvis forward. And, okay, I guess I didn't need the wheel, but you could use <laughs> Could use the wheel and then come up and work on the arm strength here. Open the chest and then come down. Okay, I hope you like this one. It's a little bit more challenging and then as you're ready, you can remove the blocks and put the feet on the block and then use the pressure of the hands here to push yourself towards the wall so that you can do it without the blocks. Okay, hope you enjoy it. Thanks.